From a deli counter to television station, Amy Stoltz has worked plenty of jobs. Through it all, she's nurtured her creative side. As a kid with talent, she was encouraged to keep painting. Stoltz is now growing her work while staying true to her art. Her own corner? Tucked away. That's where Amy Stoltz unleashes her mind. Really adding like those little tiny details that give that expression on that face just a little bit more, you know? Like you can, you can feel what that person's thinking on the page and it's just like quirky and fun and just like upbeat and I just love to kind of feel happy when I paint. So <laughs> just like every time I look at a painting, I want to kind of feel that all over again. Amy Stoltz is always ready to try something new, from painting on t-shirts to lampshades to lately resin jewelry. Not working out too well, but <laughs> we're still trying. <laughs> but it's just an experience, right? And I think that's the most important thing an artist can remember is just don't let go of who you are. The studio is a space to experiment, create, and reflect. Staying away from the norm, like just really getting myself down on the page. At first, she kept her art to herself. Now, Stoltz has come out of her shell. Just to see the expression on people's faces, I think that's why I keep painting because it's, it's really awesome when someone connects to your piece and you didn't expect it. So it's kind of like a little high that you get when you just, I don't know, you really appreciate that. In Prince George, Stoltz sells most pieces through word of mouth, but now she's harnessed the power of the internet. A lot of my stuff has taken off online, like through the States and Europe, and I had no idea that I was even there until, you know, I clicked a button, right? So, that was pretty cool. Her unique take on the world, appreciated near and far. Camille McDonald, CKPG News.